Hi, Cerberus here, back with another Distance Incremental video, episode 21, and I have three E20 Higgs bosons. It's enough to actually get both these upgrades. There's gain 666 has more gluons. That seems pretty OP because you know, you know, you know what? If I go, if I go here, go to gauge bosons, I can get enough gluons to get a ton more theory points. That's 30 theory points. Along with that, I can also double gain of the anti-version of this color. Um, I have it for red. Uh, not, not for red. I can, now I can do it for, yeah, 60 theory points. This is huge. This means I can just I can do a ton more stuff in the theory tree. I probably want to get this and this and maybe something prions or maybe just like this. Or I'm not even sure what I want to get. I I, maybe I should get prions. Uh, I don't. I don't really think I need prions. I think I just want like super symmetric particles. Maybe this and this. I don't know. That's just what I'm gonna do here. I'm close to 2,000 accelerons and scalar bosons. I can. I, I can get all of these upgrades now. All of a sudden. So the soft gap to the pathogen upgrade one. Its effect is nerfed, and pathogen upgrade one is a bet, better formula. That seems pretty powerful because they went from one. 0.3 E5 to 1.44 E5. There's also atomic rank scaling starts even later based on your Higgs bosons. I guess that's good. Yeah, that got up to 1.48 E5. Infinity 10.4 uses a better formula. 1.52 E5. Infinity 10.10 uses a better formula. 1.56 E5. So I guess that's good. I don't really need to grind Higgs anymore. I guess I'll just get these upgrades. Um, and this will allow me, to, well, this, this is E16, so unfortunately, can't really do anything with that. I think instead, oh yeah, Graviton Boosts, whatever Graviton Boosts are. I don't even know where it is. Here it is. You have four E18 Gravitons, this is the multiplier gauge force gain, which I think just boosts everything in bosons. And then your Gravitons have produced four Graviton Boosts, which are making you gain... 16 times as many elementaries on reset. That's actually really useful because this means I can start grinding a ton of elementaries. And I'm actually, the next upgrade here is actually 4,000, which means I kind of want to go for it because it will take a little longer, but it's still like five to six minutes. And then this unlocks new theory tree upgrades and the theoretical boost formula is much slower. This means I'm going to get even more theory points. I'm looking at super symmetric particles. Even with like the string being E8 universes, I'm getting like nothing here. So I think I can just, I mean, it's definitely not as strong as it could be, but I guess I'll just do this to pass the time. Okay, so I've grinded up to 40 gigameters of entangled strings, and you can see I am approaching 4,000 accelerons and this means I'm gonna be able to like do a lot more stuff here so this is actually now maxed so I don't really need accelerons I mean I could I don't even know what the perk accelerator is it's probably something to do with ascension um, so this perk accelerator is, is making um, perks used faster but they're stronger I really don't think that this effect is all that powerful, so I will not want to go for, um, I won't need to go for accelerons anytime soon. So, gain a theoretical booster, I can actually start, I can gain a whole lot of theoretical boosters. This is actually OP. This single thing allowed me to get 362 theory points. This is insane. This means I can like, also there's a whole bunch of upgrades here. Oh my god. The amount of upgrades like doubled. I guess I okay. I'll reset my elementary tree. There's a ton I can do here. I don't even know what to go for. There's and these are all expensive. There's like the string effects are stronger. I don't really think I want this generally. I think what I want to do is um, pathogen upgrades are strong are stronger based on your bosons. Just let's see how. How much this scales? So that's okay. I probably want one, and then this. Path jump upgrades are stronger is just so OP. 
I can't even get any of this. The EP or elementary and soft pack soft cap is weaker, and each graviton boost is twice as strong. Um, okay, that's useful for grinding elementaries. There's also a cadaver thing. Collapse milestone ten uses a better formula. I guess that's good. And I guess I'll take I'll take these cheap ones. They're yeah they're very cheap. Look at this. This is extremely powerful. There's a slept on produce also boost squark gain. There's just so much. I don't even know what to go for. There's so much here. There's um, I, don't, I don't want accelerons. I guess I get one of these. Um, do I want prions? All right, I do want the theoretical boosters cost less. That's actually something. Um, actually, what I can do is I can just go into a very specialized build and just buy this and see if I can get anything else. No, I can't. Um, but now, I, yeah, I have even more theory points, which means that I can do a lot. I have 668 now. So maybe I want to go into a specialized string build. So um, in this case, I'm going to probably want like one of all of these and then get a bunch of these these are very expensive so I'm not really sure if I, how much I want them maybe I want a few general things just like this and this and and then I guess I'll just yeah I'll just use this and I'll spend the rest of of all this like into these cheap upgrades here and now, if I go for strings, I can get Giga Meteor Kanachi. Now, this is actually quite, this is a very weak, unfortunately. Like, even the super symmetric particle gain is weak. So instead, if I wanted to do a build like that, I should go into super symmetry. Well, actually, I thought I already did a bunch of stuff here. But maybe I can get all of these. The last one was really expensive. The Tomo's tree upgrade effect is, what is the tree upgrades again? It's been so, I don't uh, yeah, it's really been a long time. I guess I just want to get this. I got an achievement to the next rank, whatever that is. Is it this one? No, it's this one. Um, reach E33 Ascension Power. All strings are gained 25% faster. Okay. I guess that's good. Um, I guess I want to, like, just get a bunch of these upgrades, and then a bunch of these, and then a bunch of these, if I want to get, um... If I want to like use my strings, my strings, and get a whole bunch of um, of all of these, and this actually seems powerful because that's isn't this like a huge gain to everything? It's a huge gain to quark gain, lepton gain, graviton gain, and photon gain. Well, may maybe now I should just I should use a different build since I have all of all of these um just <laughs> all all of uh, the super symmetric particles. Now I can go into um, just like a more general build. So like pathogen upgrades, cadavers, knowledge and Higgs. I don't even want anything super super symmetry. Um, get a couple of these upgrades because these these are actually quite cheap now. So I, I can max this. This is only 30. 40. So I want to get a couple of these. Probably one of these. I can get even this. And I don't really need I need the prion stuff. Just get this, and get, I guess I can get that. And maybe this is going to be really good for stuff bosons. No, I thought this would be faster, but this is quite weak. Maybe like with a better build, I can get I can enter the theory verse and do more with this. So like if I well, this gets expensive fast, um, and then get like all of these all of these and then just something really powerful or at least decently powerful cadavers miscellaneous knowledge and higgs um i guess keep getting miscellaneous and that's everything end of the theory verse is this going to do anything i hope that this will do it because um yeah these, these upgrades are expensive or not expensive but like Let's let's see. Oh, there it is. Sixty-four theory points. Can I do it at depth seven now? Hopefully, I, let, let's see if I. This will be one hundred and twenty-eight if I can do it. And also, I have a few more theory points to play with here. So, 
guess I can do this and just get a couple of these upgrades. And, oh, 90%, but not quite there. So, that's at least I got one there. If I want to, maybe I want to focus on something else now. Um, oh, not import. Maybe I want to go for prions. Like, what if I can get this based on fermions? What if I would just, like, just spam into this upgrade so I can gain prions much faster? I mean, it's decent, but this still is, isn't all that fast. It's based on fermions, which is, is this, um, which is elementary particles, which is another thing I can go for, actually, because, well, I'm getting, I'm already getting 16, like, elementaries, and, like, for every time I actually reset, so maybe this will, this will be, Powerful if I can actually if I can go to theory tree. If I can go into EP gain and elementaries, I can get this. And this will if I this how many will this give? This will give I think that's 256 elementaries. This is OP for like what this is. So I probably wanna um I probably want to get a few of these upgrades, some of these upgrades. I don't even need anything super symmetry. I could go for this, but I don't really need it. I guess I can get some of the miscellaneous. Um, I, of course, the pathogen upgrades. Why do I always forget about that? It's like the most powerful one. And this is a, probably a decent build for grinding elementary. So if I want, maybe I can I can reset at, this is 250,000. So... Uh, oh, oh, another zero, and then just do this. And elementaries could take a really small amount of time or a really large amount of time because it's resetting for something. Um, I probably shouldn't even be going for two fifty thousand. What if I just did? What if I use just one, so I could elementary as quickly as possible, so I can grind elementaries because that would be OP. And also, I'm just gonna. Put everything into fermions because this is based on fermions and it's quite power it's a quite powerful upgrade for prions so yeah this seems this seems pretty good when i'm actually getting them out all the way up to 1800 elementaries i feel like that's pretty good i wanted to i could also focus on ep gain and maybe i could just try to see if i'm close to the next mechanic now because I feel like I've grinded a bunch of just everything. Let's just see how far I can get if I go into a general build. So get this, um, get a few upgrades of this. Cadavers, um, get a couple miscellaneous. Um, get this. I don't need anything with any of this. Um, probably want even a few more levels of this and this. Could also just try to get a few more of these upgrades and this miscellaneous one. And there's not much else I can do. I can, I can just do stuff with super symmetric particles, I guess. And hopefully this... I'm 88%. This is actually quite close. And I'm one endorsement away. This is actually... I'm actually quite close. I'm not quite there yet, but... I'm very close. Maybe what I can do instead is I never actually focused on EP gain. So what if I focused on that and then just did like a general build like this. We're getting this. Maybe I can even get this. And let's see. This is E7. Okay, there really shouldn't be a confirmation for this. So what I'm actually going to do is, is I'm going to um, set auto elementaries to E7 elementary particles. And I'm actually going to put 50%. I'm just going to put all of it into fermions. And hopefully with all of this, I'll put a, put some into bosons as well. But hopefully if I like put everything into fermions, this will, like, or if I put a bunch into fermions, this will make this upgrade way more powerful, which means I can get even more, um, like, an entangled, or whatever, whatever they are, like, even more theory points. And maybe actually I could try to go for another theory verse run. 
So I can even I can even gain and this is just gigameters. It's not nothing really special with strings. I could try to do stuff with strings, but I think I just want to get some fermions and um, now disable the automation and go into a completely different build because this is going to be it's going to be OP when this actually works. Hopefully, put everything into this. And yeah, that, that 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 that's all I can do. I guess I can. Yeah, there's not really any point getting this. It's five e four for per second. It's it's decent. It's not as powerful as I thought it might be, but it's definitely something. And what if now I go back into the theory tree, reset, put everything into this, like very close to the next, but maybe. If I can get a theoretical booster, no, I can't actually. Okay, never mind. Maybe I can just go for strings instead, or super symmetry. Actually, no, yeah, strings. What if I, what if I just like put everything into this? Um, actually, that's very weak. Never mind. What if I do this though? Put a whole bunch into like this. I can even, I can even get like a pathogen upgrade one. Get a whole bunch of super symmetry stuff. Is this gonna do anything for me? I, I I remember I need I need these upgrades before anything else, and this is like after I get all the strings. So um, I don't even think yeah, super symmetric particles are gained faster. Yeah, I'm gonna want that. Just get as much of this as I can, then as much as this, and now am I gonna get a lot of? Mm, this is decent. All right. I, I feel like this is only a couple orders of magnitude better. Maybe I can enter the theory first, though. I feel like if I can do this, just I'm not sure if I should really get this, um, but I can try. Um, and then just get some general, just like stuff like this. I could even get the miscellaneous. But maybe now I can enter the theory first and actually make it. No, this is not the right build. Instead, maybe I can go for just pathogen upgrades instead of like focusing on the theory verse. Like I, I can go crazy with this, and then uh, I guess this, and then hopefully this will do it. Perhaps I'm I'm gonna try with this build. Hopefully, if I go crazy on pathogen upgrades, this will um, help everything else. To the point where I can actually do it. Uh, eighty-seven percent. I can't. Wait, no. I haven't even entered the theory verse yet. Oh, this is even more disappointing. Ninety-seven percent. Actually, it's close enough that I kind of want to grind all the way to the end because if I can make it to the end, this is becoming worse and worse every time. <laughs> this doesn't do anything. Um. If I can make it, this I think allows me to get one more of the theoretical boosters cost less upgrade, which means I can get even more boosters. I'm just gonna grind this off camera and like and just get this and hopefully with this this will put me over the edge to getting enough theory points to make to the next mechanics. Actually I didn't even need to grind off camera, I just went out of the tab and then went back in and got the theory points. But this episode is getting along, so hope you enjoyed. Peace out.